Hey guys, my Touch 247 here, and today I will be showing you how to completely beat the game Doors with an extra O in between. Um, I've noticed it's been pretty popular lately, so I went and got it, figured out how to beat all the levels, and I will be showing you how to do that today. Now I'm going to have to go through these pretty quick because my YouTube channel is limited to 15 minute videos. So we'll begin at the home screen, we'll let's go to New Game, and we'll go into it. Now, I'm sure that if you're watching this video, you already know how to play, so we'll just skip the details on how to play and get to how to beat the levels. First door, easy. Open it, go in. Second level, tilt the phone sideways to the left, click in, go in. Third level, tilt to the left, see the key, pick up the key, click the key, open the door, go in. Fourth level, pull on the string, the door will start to slide, click on it when it is open. On the fifth level, on the far left lamp, click on it, it'll pop up, grab the doorknob underneath it, select the doorknob, put it in the door, open the door, go in. Sixth level, you will see the little yellow square on the left in the middle. You will want to just click that on and off a bunch of times until all the dots above the door have turned green. Click on the door, open it, go right in. Seventh level, there are code things for this. Um, what the code is, on the left side, it goes black, white, black. And on the right side, it goes white, black, white. Just like that. And then you open the door, go right in. Eighth level, um, right to the left bottom of the door, there's a little red thing in the wall. You just select that out. It'll appear in your menu bar. You just slide the door open to the left and go in. Ninth level, you see the spinning wheel and it turns green. And on the right side, we will click the wheel. And just like that, when the holes are both on green, you clicked on the door and it opened, and you go in. Pretty easy, I guess. Tenth level, you shake the device back and forth. It puts the fire up. You op or you click on the fire. It pops up. You s grab the little crank thing underneath. Then you move the plant on the left side further to the left. You select the crank, put it in the middle circle, click on it, and it takes the door right up. Go right in. Eleventh level, you take the pin that you pulled out of the wall earlier from the menu bar and put it in the hole right above the middle door. And you click on the door twice and it will open the second time. Click in, go right in. Twelfth level, you see the card symbols up on top. Now the upside down ones are the backwards color if you want to call it. So the top left is black, the top or the middle left is red. And the bottom left is red as well. And the top right is red. And then the middle right remains white. And then the bottom right is black. And you click on the door, open it, go right in. Then on the 13th level, you just tilt your device back and forth. Unlock the door, go in. There's a spider web. Grab the fire from the left fire. And select it from your menu bar. Click on the spider web, disappears, and go right in. 14th level, you see the slash across the top of the screen. You take the up and down dial things, and starting on the left is the highest, and on the far right is the lowest, you make a slash. Just like that. Then you open the door, go right in. 15th level, on the bottom right of the screen, you see a little bomb thing, which it actually is a bomb. Select the bomb, take it from your menu, Put it in front of the door, light it with the fire from an earlier level, it goes off, and it reveals the key to how to pull on the chain thing. So it goes left, right, left, 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 right, right. Open the door, go right in. 16th level, took me a while to beat, but what it is, is the man is laying face down, and so you have to take your phone, or whatever device you're on, and put it screen down level, and then while it's still screen down, click on the door and it will open, and then you can go in. 17th level, if you slide the rock to the left, you see a light switch. You see the letters ET when you turn the light off, and it has nothing to do with the actual letters themselves, just how many blocks are in the letters. So if we count on the left and the E, there's 11 blocks, and on the right and the T, there is seven. So if we turn the light back on, on the left clock, we will point it to 11, and on the right, we will point it to 7. Open the door, go in. 
18th level, you just click on the little buttons that make the ball go up. And it opens both sides of the door. You go right in. 19th level, on the left side, you slide the door up. Click on the button, slide it back down. On the right side, slide it up. All the way up, actually. And you'll see the orange ball. And then you hit the button after you selected the orange ball. And slide the door back down. Then from your menu, you take the orange ball. And at the top, middle, you will see a little button that you click on. And the ball goes up, hits it. And then you can slide the door up and go in. 20th level is kind of hard uh, to explain. What it is is the two dials, like on the top, middle, and bottom, they match each other. And so, like, um, they're a mirror image of each other. So whatever is on the left top has to mirror what is on the right top. So let's see if I can show you what I mean. So if we go like that, they are mirrored. They're a mirror image of each other. And then the middle one has to be a mirror as well. And there's no real, like, pattern to these. They're just all randomized. So you'll have to figure this one out kind of for yourself. But once they're all mirrored, you can click on the door, open it, and go right in. And then 21st level, you lay your phone down on a level surface screen up, which will... Open, unlock the door, you slide the door open and go right in. 22nd level, uh, there's actually a hidden panel right here. And then there's a magnifying glass. Select the magnifying glass. And on the right tiger, you will see a little roundish thing by his um, rear. And you tap on that. It'll show you a bunch of different fruits and veggies. And what you have to do is match the colors of the buttons to the colors of the fruits or veggies so the top one's an orange so you put your orange ball in that hole and then if we go back to the image it's um yellow purple so it's yellow purple and then it is strawberry so red and then green yellow red then we can open the door go right in and then 23rd level, all you do is slide everything to the right, see the button, click on the button, then slide so you can get at the door again, slide the door open, and go right in. 24th level, took me a while as well, what you actually have to do is light both of the fires with the fire from your menu bar. And then starting on the right with the chains, and then you'll go one to the left, one to the left, one to the left, so now you're at the farthest left, and then from there you'll go one to the right, one to the right, one to the right, if that makes sense. I'll just show you. So we'll start at the far right, and then go one to the left, one to the left, one to the left, and one to the right, one to the right, one to the right. And that will melt the ice. Then you can go right in and eat the level. 25th level, you have these things that go up and down underneath, and what you actually have to do is use your magnifying glass. And you will go on the Japanese flag right underneath the American flag if you didn't know which flag it was. And it will show you two numbers that you can kind of decipher to be 2562. And that stands for how many boxes there needs to be on the bottom. So it goes 2562. Open the door, go right in. 26 level, just slide the ladder over, click on the little chain, click on the left chain, it makes the door spin. And click on the right chain, it makes it stop, and so what you have to do is line it up with the hole that you can go in, and go in. And then 27th level, the order that you feed the balls to the monster is by color that appears the least to the most, and so it goes yellow, blue, red, orange. And that opens the door, and you go right in. 28th level, pretty simplistic, you just turn your volume up and down couple times and the door will go up and then you go in 28th level you select the knife at the bottom right then from your menu select it again and you just tap on these little weeds and cut them up and then you can slide the two doors open if you see the little key there select the key unlock the door go right in 30th level you have to spin the penguins to look at each other so, we can make them look at each other, and we can open the door and go in. 
Then 31st level, all you do is hold your phone or device upside down until all the green things have turned green, all, all the circle things, and go in, beat the level. 32nd level, tilt your phone to the right, the rock slides over, goes onto the button that you have to place it on, then take your fire and tap on the bugs and the bugs go away. And open the door and go in, pretty easy. 33rd level, you take your knife from a previous level and you cut the power cord to the lasers and then you actually has nothing to do with this rabbit thing but what you have to do is um, slide the door to the right once and then to the left four times and then to the right twice and that opens the door and you go in 34th level you'll see the clocks up above what you have to do is tilt your device in the direction that the hands are pointing. So on the first, on the left side, we will tilt it to the left, and then that way, that way, upside down, and upside up. So if working your way from left to right, you tilt your phone, would that would be pointing in the same direction as the clock hands would be pointing. So if you can understand that, uh, you open the door, go right in. 35th level, also the last level, you select your fire from uh, the menu and you can light both of the candles, it reveals colors on the wall and again you have those box things and what you have to do is however many letters are in the colors you have to raise your boxes that many so like in yellow there are six and so we have to have six boxes and then blue has four and then white has five and orange has six as well. Six. Then you click on the door, open it, go in, and you have beaten the game. So that's how you beat the game doors. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions that uh, about the game that you didn't understand from this video, like if I went too fast on one of these levels, uh, just um, leave your question in the comment section. Uh, please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe this video. Share it with whoever else wants to beat the game. And thanks for watching. Have a nice day.